go to Waijung 2 User Guide. Click ESP32 Target, then Utilities, and finally, Basic Custom Code Block. The Basic Custom Code Block can be used to create a Simulink block using your own custom C code. Scroll down to find the demo for this block. This example demonstrate how the custom code block can be used to implement a simple counter using the C programming language. Under the topic demo, download the ESP32 underscore basic underscore custom code underscore demo dot SLX. Next, download the basic underscore custom code underscore demo underscore lib dot zip and extract the content. Copy the extracted folder to the same folder as the model file. The zip file contains a .c file and a .h file. These files serve as the C library where the counter logic is implemented. Open MATLAB Simulink and change the current folder to the folder where the downloaded files are available. Open the Simulink model. In the custom code block mask, change the path of the source and header files to the extracted C library folder. Open the target setup block mask, and go to the ESP32 tab. Select the COM port where the ESP32 microcontroller is connected. Next, select the correct ESP32 family and the flash size. Then, go to Apps tab at the top of the Simulink window and select Embedded Coder App. Finally, in the C Code tab, Press the Build button to compile and upload your model to the ESP32 microcontroller. Wait for the build process to complete. Open the PuTTY application and configure the COM port and the baud rate, to open the serial monitor. You should be able to see the following output on the serial monitor. 